Hello, my name is Peter Schmelauer and I am co-author of the Kanokofi software. Let me take you on a short tour through the main ways of Kanoko software use. This tour is divided into four parts, corresponding to data import, executing first analysis, exploring analysis results and performing constraint ordination. I will use the plant community data as an example but Kanoko 5 can be just as easily used with data coming from the fields of marine biology, landscape ecology, numeric taxonomy, molecular biology or sociology. You can see on the screen a spreadsheet with two sheets. The first one, named plants, contains a data table with the estimates of cover for individual plant species, representing by individual columns, as recorded in selected 20 grassland plots, represented here by the rows. The empty cell corresponds to zero cover when a plant species is absent from the particular plot. Using this data set, I will try to summarize the variation in the plant community composition with the help of unconstrained ordination. I will interpret those results using information about the environmental conditions at the plots and about the agricultural management of their sites. This information is stored in the second sheet named environment. Column B records the depth of the upper soil horizon with the soil moisture shown in the next column and followed by a factor variable characterizing management type and then a semi-quantitative variable representing the amount of applied manure. I need to import both data tables into Kanoko 5, creating a new project. To do so, I will move into Kanoko 5 workspace and select in the file menu the import project from Excel command, which opens the import wizard. First, I select the Excel file to be imported. Which is this one. And on the following page, I check both sheets of the Excel file and further specify that the data in these two sheets will create two data tables in the project. The import of each of the two data tables will be specified by a pair of wizard pages. So the next page displays options for the first data table. At this moment, I shall specify unique terms for table rows and columns, both in singular and plural form. I will replace the term sample suggested for table rows with more appropriate plot plots and make the term species more specific by adding plant species. This implies however that I must type the plural form myself. Kanonko 5 will remember my new choice and offer it the next time I create data tables. The name of the new data table will correspond to sheet name. So plants and I confirm that the data come from this sheet by selecting the sheet name here. It is also important to tell the wizard that the empty cells shall be interpreted as zeros for this data table rather than as missing values which is specified already here. Finally I want to emphasize the choice of data table type. For the first data table it is set to compositional data by default, which is a correct choice for my data set. It means that all the variables, namely plant species in this table, are measured in the same unit and that it makes sense to sum them up and compute a relative share of individual species in this total value. It is important that I set this information correctly because it is used by the Kanoko advisor to suggest appropriate type of ordination method for my data. 
on the next page, the contents of the sheet is previewed, reflecting the wizard guesses about the valid rows and columns and the labels which are present in the data. It might be useful to mention that all the wizard pages and also all dialogues in Canonical 5 can be enlarged by dragging their edges or corners, as I do now. The wizard guesses do not need any adjustment for this dataset. So I click the next button again and specify now the options for the other data table we need to import. I keep the term for table rows. As these two tables share the sampling units, but the column term must be changed to, say, environmental variables. The resulting table will be named environment and its data come from the environment sheet. Note that the suggested type of this data table is correct again, namely a general data table as it makes no sense to some sort that with moisture or with the management type. At the next page, you see again a correctly chosen range of rows and columns, and I close the wizard now with the finish button. The Excel data are now imported and shown in the Kanoko 5 workspace, but Kanoko Advisor displays now a dialog, allowing me to quickly set up my first analysis on these data and I will describe it in the second part of our tour of Kanoko 5.